Hello, and what's up, YouTube? So, <clears throat> I'm just getting over some sickness, so if you hear it in my voice, that's exactly what it is, okay? <coughs> Ricola and medicine and all that jazz. So, yeah. So, first thing I want to touch on is that you guys know that my birthday passed February 12th. I had an awesome time. It was so great. And I was supposed to be, um, I'm supposed to put up like this long list of videos. But, <clears throat> first, starting with how I made this new hair, if you can't tell. But, I'm just going to do a quick story behind it, and then <clears throat> I'll let you know what happened. So I started doing my hair myself. Um, I started sewing it on. I was making a video for it. And then um, <clears throat> me and my sister went out, and um, I wore my other hair piece. And so we come home, and my mom is, like, all the way, like, up here, almost done with it. And I was like... And she said that she just wanted to do it to help me out, which was really sweet. But, um, yeah, so she pretty much finished the hair for me so I don't have, um, uh, any footage to show you guys. I mean, I have a little bit, but it'd be pretty much null and void. So, that being said, I'm going to buy some more hair in a little bit, and it's going to be straight hair, um, because I just want to make one more hair piece, and then I'm finished, um, just so I can have, like, you know, curly, straight, blah, 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 so I don't have to wear one over and over again. So, that being said, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, now we're here for February favorites. I'm on time this time, and, um, <clears throat> I don't have many favorites this month. I have a few. Not a lot, but, like, these things are awesome. So, first, I'm going to start with <clears throat> this. I just bought this, um, <clears throat> I bought it at the beginning of February, or I think end of January, whatever, and, um, it's the Shea So Real from BlackOnyxWorld.com, and this, I put this on my natural hair whenever I get out the shower, it makes my hair feel so soft, whenever I blow dry the front pieces of my hair, it's so shiny, silky, everything above, <clears throat> We all know that shea butter is fabulous for hair. Um, <clears throat> it locks in that moisture. It does exactly what it says it's going to do. I just hate the packaging because this lid comes off so easily. And then the product gets everywhere off the lid. See? And it just, it'll stick to everything. But yeah, this is like the best stuff ever. So I might put it in something else because it's really kind of gross. So, um, <clears throat> the next thing I've been loving is this Mint Julep Mask from Queen Helene. And this stuff is really great. Like, it really, like, sucks all the oil out your face. Um, I had it on last night, and, you know, it has, like, this great cooling sensation when you're putting it on. And then I also use it when I see, like, you know, those cystic pimples that are, like, really underneath the skin. I dab some of this on there, and the next morning it's completely flat, like, no joke. So, this is like beauty in a tube, so, good stuff from Queen Helene, and I think this was like two bucks at Walmart, so, and you get, uh, eight ounces or 226 grams, so this is really great. I just don't like how it comes out, it like comes out in like one big glop, but not a big deal for me because I love it. Um, so next is like, okay, it is this L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara. So, quick story on my mascara history. I am like, Maybelline is like one of the best mascara brands to me. Because I tried a L'Oreal mascara and I did not like it. I think it was the collagen, the black collagen one. Ugh. Um, but Maybelline has had some good mascaras. They have the Great Lash, which is fabulous for its pr 
I like for its price range. It's amazing. Um, there's the falsies. They have the uh, vibrating mascara that I loved for a long time. Um, let me see what else. Do they have? I think they have the lash stiletto. Um, hold on, let me look in my box. Um, the lash stylist, which is a really good mascara. So Maybelline did me justice in the past as far as mascara goes. But, 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 I heard Makeup Geek talk about this mascara. I think my girl Naomi talks about this mascara. Um, I think, uh, Still Glamorous talked about this mascara. So I was like, okay, so I'm going to try this. And, you know, if it doesn't work, whatever. I still need to go back and try the million, but this is going to, you know, I'm repurchasing this. This makes your lashes so long. It gets it so full at the base, and it separates them all. It looks so beautiful. I love this mascara. I will go back and buy ten of them. This mascara is so good, and it's probably like $7 or something like that. It is amazing. I need to find some coupons for it so I can stock up this mascara. Like, I'm sorry. Okay, the falsies is good, but this one is better. Sorry. Um, yeah. I used these com com combined together, and it really gave me a nice, um, thing. So, working with these together are fabulous. I love this so much. I, I'm definitely going to go back and get more of this, but I am definitely going back to get more of these. Like, ugh. oh, I love that mascara. Okay, <clears throat> the next one, this is like, everybody talks about these, and I was kind of like, you know, I don't like makeup wipes in the first place, but I was like, you know what, my, my, <clears throat> my skin was breaking out, and so I was like, well, you know, maybe it's because I'm not using a makeup wipe and just washing my face and there's still makeup left. So maybe if I use a makeup wipe, get makeup off that way, then wash my face, then less makeup will be on my face in the end. So, um, yeah. So I heard about these makeup wipes here on YouTube, but I was like, you know, everybody's reading about them. They're probably not even that great. So, because, because of the makeup wipes that I tried in the past, and pretty much the only makeup wipes that I tried in the past were Equate and Elf. And Equate sucked, and Elf was, meh, okay, it stunk, pretty much, really. So, that was kind of where I was. And so, I got the Neutrogena, um, makeup wipes, and these work amazingly. Like, it feels like you don't even have makeup on after you take it off. Like, it's that good, so, um, and it's called a cleansing towelette. So, <clears throat> it really works. It works fabulously. Um, you know, I thought it would be less price for how many you get. I mean, six, six, seven dollars for twenty-five, eh, you know, but, you know, I just wish more came in a package so you wouldn't have to keep going back. So, I guess next time I'll get two of these, you know, when I go. So, I know I have at least one more. Oh, yeah. So, this. It was in my favorite video last month, but I've been using this pretty much like every day. I don't have it on today, but, you know, you know, I was rushing today to do my makeup so I can do this video, and then I can go make something to eat, and then I can go to work, so I won't be late. But, yeah, so this is the Lust palette from um, Wet n Wild, and this is the color icon. I pretty much wore this, like, every day, like, it's not even a joke. Like, oh, like, like, like. Um, when I go out and I do this, it just looks fabulous. I even um, threw in one of my hip duos and put that inside the um, inner half of my lid and then put these outer. Oh, it looks so good. This is my favorite color inside of this thing because it's like a pink kind of color. Oh. I love it so much. Like, I love this palette. This is my favorite one. Everybody um, talks about Vanity, but this one is my favorite, which is Lust. I love this one. And last, but definitely not least, 
is the shirt that I'm wearing now, and I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's called, it, oh, it's called, huh, I didn't know shirts are called things. It says, 21 and hot, buy me a shot. So, um, yeah, because one of my best friends, Keisha, bought me this shirt um, for my birthday, and I love this shirt. I love being 21. Woo! This is my February favorite. Um, I'll probably do a tutorial using the Lust palette tomorrow for a nice date night look. So, be looking out for that, okay? I'll see you in a little bit, guys. Bye.